The day of the clinic finally arrived. I was super excited and yet so nervous at the same time. I was actually trembling during the first 5 minutes of my own clinic. Anyway, I'm going to show you some highlights as well as a big blunder I made during the performance. Remember that Gavin Harrison tune I challenged myself to perform to test my courage? And just like that, the whole thing was over. I came away from it experiencing mixed feelings. This was certainly one of the hardest things that I've made myself do. Things didn't go smoothly too. There was a huge jam on the way to the venue. We were missing a bass drum lick at first and had to change the drum set. There was a slight issue with setting up the PA monitors which had to go on the floor eventually. All these produced delays and made me even more nervous than I wanted to be. And to all the worries that I experienced, am I going to screw this song up? Am I going to screw that song up? That person in the crowd has a frown on her face. Are people really going to be interested in what I have to say or are they going to be bored? So on and so forth. I just thought to myself, I'm going to allow myself to screw up. People might get bored and frown, but it's okay. My focus is just to give value to those who aren't bored. My focus is to play the next note, the next and the next and just be present in the music that I'm performing. And in doing so, this clinic was also one of the simplest things I've ever had the pleasure to do. After all, teaching, sharing and performing comprises such a large part of my DNA and I was simply doing what makes me authentic and what makes me real. At the same time, trying not to care about anything else and just be present in those authentic moments that were created for me. And that is the last thing I wanted to share with you this year. Thank you for allowing me to guide you and share what I love with you all through 2019. Hope to see you in 2020. Meanwhile, don't stop dreaming and don't stop drumming. <laughs>